What's up everybody, this is Reese here from C Manga and welcome to my review of Hajimina Echo chapter 1106, He Can Do Anything and holy shit, that was an amazing chapter. As the title says, Takamura can do anything, man. And now I was thinking that Takamura didn't absorb anything during that break. Um, you know, that long ass explanation that the coach gave him, he must have literally gone unconscious towards the end of it. Uh, he absorbed all that information, man. So like, damn, that right he unleashed was friggin' crazy. So like, Takamura truly is a genius. It's like, if you hit him with something, expect him to be able to use that back against you. So like, this whole match so far, um, I can really understand like why Bison keeps calling him a thief. It's like not just because you know he stole his chance to fight Eagle again, but also because he keeps stealing his goddamn moves. You know, first there's a flicker, now there's his flicker counter. He stole the Detroit. He tried to imitate the Detroit style. Detroit style. It's like, damn, that set, using that counter against him, man. Takamura is disgusting. So, there you have it. You know, Bison, he finally went down. And you know what? I was so, I was, I'm fully, I was obviously fully expecting him to get back up. You know, there was no doubt in my mind that he wasn't going to be getting back. Yeah, he was, wasn't going to get up. Um, you know, it was obviously like, it's too soon for it to be over. Um, but you can kind of understand why the crowd would be thinking, yeah, that's it. Unification done. Unification done. So, I mean, how many times in all these matches has Takamura literally finished it off with just one blow? Um, obviously, you know, we know that, obviously, we saw that um, Vice only twisted at the end, so obviously it lessened the impact of it. You know, he was able to absorb it a bit more, but still, uh, I swear, ever since Date used that against Ippo way back in the day, it seems like it's kind of like the norm on the world, on, on the world level, so all these power punches, they seem to just easily get neutralized, you know, Ippo, he needs to kind of come up with something new if he's going to be able to compete at this stage, because, like, that's all he really has, you know, just power punch, power punch, power punch, and if people are, like, easily going to just twist and lessen it, he's going to be in some serious trouble, um, but anyway, back to the, back to the chapter, um, yeah, Bison, he got up, but he was damn shaky towards the end, it's like, honestly, the next round is going to be really interesting, because obviously both fighters are pretty shaky, it's like, Bison, he got up, he's there shaking away, Takamura's just like, I'm going to give you this, I'm going to allow you this one, you have my respect for being able to get back up. Um, but at the same time, it's like it's obviously revealed during that thing that Takamura himself couldn't actually finish it because he didn't have the strength left to do it, you know? It's like, ah, that one strike he threw out, that was literally him going all out. So, yeah, next round is going to be a really interesting one. Both of these fighters are taking a lot of damage. Um, obviously, you know, Takamura, he might have taken a little bit more but still, you know, they're both kind of on like, uneven footing. It's like, who's going to be able to take it? Obviously, you know, Takamori says, give me a minute and I'm going to go back in there and kick his ass. So he's definitely confident that he's going to finish this. But as we know, it's like in true Ippo fashion, it can't be over this quickly, man. These world title matches, there's no way in hell they're going to be only lasting into like the fourth round. They're usually like, I don't know, six, seven, eight, something mad like that. Even going towards the end, like 12. So yeah, this chapter friggin badass sure it was only that one strike but man it's enough to turn around this entire fight so yeah um that's about it from this chapter from me guys you know the usual thing to the end of these let me know what you thought about this chapter in the comment section below and as usual don't forget to check out our things on the channel so i'll see you on the next chapter